Hi, I'm Joan Newcomb, and today's Mystic Minute is Waiting for the Shift. I'm on my way to my very first meetup in New York, and uh, I'm going to be early, so they won't let me in. And I need to wolf down some lunch. And I happen to pass this little haven of greenery, oh my god, in the middle of the city with some little buddies waiting for me to eat. And it's just wild. I've had several uh, occurrences today that to me were like validation of parallel universes. And one was simply going on the path train to uh, a, a meeting I was going to this morning. And I had my little GPS on and it told me this the PATH train was going to leave at 10.32 and I get down there and the sign there says there's a delay and the next one's not for 17 minutes. So I'm trying to decide, oh, do I, what subway do I take? And I mean, and I went and verified it to, you know, a person in a yellow jacket there and a vest and they said, yeah, there's a delay. And then while I am sitting there deliberating, the 1032 pulls in. So I run downstairs and I I jump on it, it takes off at 1032 and I get there at precisely the time I meant to. But it was a very like the universe reorganized in my favor. And it, it was by not going to more effort or trying to make something happen. It was actually like by stopping and allowing the reorganization to happen. So we all have had tendencies and there's like a societal, cultural uh, bias towards trying really hard to do something, uh, that our actions is what makes something happen. Uh, you know, we get validated for our actions, we get an A for effort. <laughs> When working as consciousness, effort actually stops the process from happening. It slows it down. And when you can stop and allow for that quiet inside and that internal shift, the universe reorganizes in your favor. This is all happening to all of us everywhere. Is, is reality is reorganizing and you can either sit in your space of allowance, acceptance, appreciation, or you can try to make it happen faster, or you can fight it tooth and nail because your personality self would rather be in charge, or you can take your time and allow space to open. And I tell you, when you allow space to open, that's when the miracles happen. So if you like these videos, share them, comment, sign up for them, subscribe to them. And if you wanna know more about how to navigate life as consciousness, go to my website, joan-nukem.com and look at my coaching programs. So go to joan-nukem.com and I'll see you in another few days with another Mystic Minute.